Good afternoon. Manchester United have been dealt a big blow ahead of Sunday's final game against Sunday. Get top prices on the top horses at Coral. Yes, a very good morning and welcome to Big Saturday right here on Coral TV. Plenty more to come on Frankel as the show goes on. But for now, it's time for me to say good morning to you and give you a little overview of what we've got to uh, look forward to today. Right, joining me to look ahead to the Cheltenham Festival today is Nick Larkham. Now, we're looking now at day three uh, and we're looking ahead to the Juice and Novices Chase, so, which is the first race on day three, which is also St. Patrick's Day. So it'll be a fun day. So it's going to be a, a race uh, run over two and a half miles, Nick. Who do you fancy for this race? And I think all those here to celebrate St Patrick's Day might well be celebrating courtesy of wishful right, thinking. Thanks, Nick. Right then, so uh, Loosen My Load, he reckons, is uh, one to watch, but Nick Luck's selection for the Juice and Novices Chase on day three of the Cheltenham Festival is wishful thinking. This is Coral TV. Liverpool fans to get behind owner John W. Henry and chairman Tom Werner. Well, here's what he had to say today. I would hope nobody would prejudge things now. The owners have their own reasons for doing what they Dalgleish have done. Dalglish is the latest high-profile figure to leave Anfield in recent months, but Eyre has denied that the departures are a sign the club is in turmoil. Rangers in action last weekend in a draw against their arch-rival Celtic just wasn't good enough. They are one point ahead of Celtic, but Celtic do have a game in hand uh, going into today's game. So they really, really do uh, have to win today. Can they do it? We've got Mark Landon from the Racing Post to help you work it out. And finally, to football. Well, Chelsea are the last remaining English side in the Champions League, but have it all to do to get past Napoli and make the quarter-finals. That said, Chelsea are odds-on favourites to win the match, and that vital away goal could still prove crucial. But first, then, Manchester United have made their second big signing of the summer. But first this afternoon, Mark Hughes has emerged as the bookies' favourite to replace Gerard Houllier, Saturn Villa manager. We start then with Fernando Torres, as he's been told he has to react the right way to being You get dropped. top prices on the top events at Coral. Joining me this morning on Big Saturday is Chris Medland from oh, FA Next Match. And we're moving our attentions on to Sunday, where Blackpool hosts Tottenham. That game kicking off at 1.30. Do you think it could be another shock success for Ian Holloway? Hello there and welcome. I'm Hannah Kirkpatrick and this is your one-stop shop for everything equine. This is Jockey TV. Live action coming uh, from White Hart Lane at 5.30 this afternoon between Tottenham and uh, Blackpool. Harry Redknapp this week pretty much uh, admitting that their race for the Champions League is over. What do you reckon about this game then? Welcome to the latest edition of the Coral Video Blog. Uh, as ever, we have the latest news and uh, informed views. Looking back at a busy weekend of sport as well and looking ahead to another busy week of action. And So good luck for Cheltenham and join me next Monday for this week in sport.